13 Action News Update sponsored by Cox, bringing us closer. I'm Kalina Estrino with Sim right now in your 13 Action News Update. A four-year-old boy and his babysitter are safe after an hours-long hostage situation. Now, we first told you about this barricade situation happening at Motel near Blue Diamond and the I-15 yesterday. Police say it all started after an officer spotted a stolen motorcycle and car. And while he was processing both, a man tried taking the motorcycle. Officer then tried to stop him, but he took out a gun and ran into the motel where he later took those hostages. Now the man surrendered and is now facing several charges, and we are expected to learn more about the case later on today. In honor of the nine victims killed in the mass shooting in San Jose, Governor Sisolak has ordered flags to half staff until sunset on Sunday. Governor says in part, quote, our hearts ache for the families and friends who lost loved ones in this senseless tragedy. Investigators now say the victims have been targeted. Zero Fatalities Nevada wants to make sure everyone gets home safe this Memorial Day weekend. They're teaming up with Lyft once again, and they're offering $15,000 worth of free Lyft credits. Using the code SMARTRIDE2021, you can get $5 off one ride from today at 6 p.m. through Monday at 6 p.m. As we inch closer and closer to our long holiday weekend, we're going to see lots of heat paired with that. So 98 degrees today under lots of sunshine. Tomorrow we are watching a system moving in from Southern California that could bring some extra clouds and a gust or two up to 2025. Otherwise, we are staying hot and dry. We're 99 both Sunday and Monday. Memorial Day could inch closer to that triple digit mark, and we are going to hang out in the triple digits for the whole first week of June. Those highs ranging from 100 to 105 degrees. All right, Kelsey, thank you. And that was your 13 Action News update. You can find more on our website, ktmb.com and our free mobile app.